I have some great kitchen hacks for you guys. First one is back to school is here and you may have some Ziploc bags and you need a snack bag. And what do you do when you need a tiny bag? Well, you take a little cloth napkin and iron, put that on top of your bigger Ziploc bag and that's gonna seal it at the bottom. Then you can put your little carrots inside or pretzels or whatever little snacks that you want. And you have a perfect little snack bag. And then you're gonna just grab some scissors and then trim off the end and you are good to go. And this can go right into a little lunch bag. Now everybody has been here before. You have a chip bag and you do not have a clip to close your open bag. What do you do? Well, I'm gonna show you a cool hack and you don't need any clips. You're gonna take it and fold it over both sides forming a triangle. And then you're gonna flip your bag over and start rolling it down just a little bit at a time. And then you're gonna flip it back over and you're gonna see those little ends that were still left from your triangle and you're gonna fold those over and that seals it. And then that's it. You can shake it, nothing's gonna come out. Our next hack is you have a knife, you're going to cut a tomato and it's dull. What do you do? And you don't have a sharpening stone. You can grab a ceramic cup, flip it over, and you can sharpen it right there because that is the same thing as a stone. Then you're gonna cut through your tomato and you have a totally, totally sharp knife. Our next hack is for the crafter. So what do you do when you don't have a place to put your paints for your art project? Well, how about grab an egg carton? The little egg cups are the perfect place to store your colors. And then you can see them displayed while you're working on your project. And then you can grab your paint brushes and you can store them right in the center. And then that way you don't have to lean them on the table or get anything on your work surface. Our next kitchen hack is an easy way to take the shells off of a hard boiled egg. So you're gonna grab a little Tupperware, a small one, put the lid on, and it's best if you have at least two eggs in there because they, they work off of each other. So you're gonna shake it up and shake it up, not too hard, just enough that it's hitting the sides. And then look, it totally slid off. And then the other one, watch when you go to grab the skins, it totally slides off because it's been loosened by going back and forth against the sides of your Tupperware. Now I'm gonna show you something really cool and super cute for your next party that you can do with your little hard boiled eggs. You're gonna grab some Saran Wrap and roll it out on your table and then grab four skewers and they are about an inch or maybe three quarters of an inch apart. And then you're gonna grab two eggs and butt them up against each other and start rolling the eggs towards the skewers. And the goal is to get the skewers to be evenly spaced all the way around. And then what you're gonna do is you're gonna grab something to tie it off. I use these little ties because I just happen to have them in my house. But you can use whatever you have on hand. You can use some rubber bands or some string, whatever you have on hand and you're gonna pull those tight so the skewers are kind of indenting into the eggs. And you're never gonna guess what we're gonna make after we take this apart. So then you're gonna put this in the fridge for about 15 minutes, and then you're gonna take off your little binding that you have around it and unroll the surround wrap, and it's gonna expose the eggs that have like a little indent all the way around. And we're gonna cut these into, what do you think? Little flowers, how cute is that? They are literally little tiny flowers and they would be so cute on a charcuterie board or even to put in a lunch for your kids. I hope you guys love these hacks and I hope you try them for yourself. And until next time, I'm Michelle from Bella Branch DIY and thanks for watching Home Talk.